Hello, all my Cancer friends, and welcome to Indigo Goddess 1111. My name is Indigo, and I am here to bring you your February reading. Um, the first four cards will be your energy, representing the four weeks in February, with the fifth card being your overall energy. And the second row is the same thing, but um, whoever you're connecting with, whoever you're thinking about right now, whoever you're together, partnered with, whatever situation may be, but the person that you have on your mind. So Spirit and Angels, can I get four cards for Cancer, representing the four weeks of February? I apologize for my delay in getting February's readings out. We have the Hermit in reverse, the Moon in reverse, the Seven of Cups in reverse. My goodness. Okay. Okay. Can I get four cards now for um, whoever they're thinking of? Whoever they're meant to be with? Whoever they are with? What does cancer need to know about their partners? Ooh, that one really went flying. Anything else that Cancer needs to know in regards to their relationship? Anything else for Cancer? Okay. Your bottom of the deck um, for your reading is the Wheel of Fortune. So whatever um, you have been hoping for, wishing for, your good karma is coming your way. So that is a positive. I'm going to pull a card from the Romance Angels here. And then we will get started. Angels, what messages do you have for Cancer in regards to their love life and their relationships? What do you want them to know? Okay. Chemistry. So um, there's a strong magnetic attraction here. Anything else, angels? Okay. Okay, I think I'm going to clarify with the Gilded Tarot. So, um, Cancer, for a lot of you in the first couple weeks of um, February, you were not taking the time to go within and um, listen to your intuition. You are not, um, you weren't taking the time to, to look at all the facts, but I do see that the moon card here is in reverse. So something has come to light that was hidden in the dark. Secrets have come out and, um, they're no longer, um, leaving you confused. You're coming out of a state of confusion, um, things are being revealed for who they really are. People are um, showing their true colors to you. And Spirit is saying just to trust your intuition because you are all, your intuition is on point by the end of the month. At the beginning of the month, you weren't listening to it. You were not following your gut. Why is this hermit here in reverse for 
Cancer. Whoa. Why is Hermit here in reverse? eight of wands so you you had messages coming in you had people trying to tell you what was going on you may have heard from your um your partner or who you are in separation with for this group of you i think you're dealing with an ex but it could be a new relationship too why is this moon here in reverse for cancer way too many why is this moon here in reverse for Cancer? Death card. And that's what was on the top of that pile that just flew out. And I said there was too many. So secrets have come out. Things have come to light that you were refusing to see before. And it is um, it is ending something. It is uh, causing um, things to come to an end. Oops. And... Uh, You're going to start, um, yeah, oops, once these secrets come out, or if they have come out, you are just ready to end this relationship right then and there. Why is the seven of cups here in reverse for cancer? Yeah, so the ace of pentacles. So somebody had um, been promising you a new beginning, a stable um, relationship, a stable foundation to build on. And you're starting to see that that was just a illusion, that their secrets came out in the reverse. Or this could be you too, Cancer. Why is the high priestess here? Why does Cancer have the high priestess? Yeah, the moon in reverse again. So Spirit is telling you to trust your intuition when it comes to things that just don't seem right. There's secrets here. There's lies. There's deceit. And this could also be you, Cancer. I'm not sure who is keeping these secrets. Who's the moon for? Oh. Way too many. Why is the moon here in reverse under the, the um, high priestess? Okay, I'm not going to take this because there's way too many, but um, why is this moon here in reverse? The Knight of Swords could be an air sign that you have to be careful of, but there's fast communication coming in, fast um, information that's going to be brought to light. That whatever was done in the dark is coming to light, and it's going to cause you to have to choose whether to stay or whether to go. And they are acting cold to you. It's leaving you up in your head, Cancer. Why is this Ten of Pentacles in reverse for their partner? For a group of you, the person you are connecting with, um, you have already split up from. This is an ex. Um, you thought they were the one for you. You thought they, you were going to have that be with them for the rest of your life, but they have the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, clarified by the Six of Cups in reverse. So this is somebody from your past. This is an ex who you felt abandoned you at one time. And you have been fighting for this connection. You have been trying to get a hold of them. Um, the Queen of Swords is clarified by the devil in reverse. So um, there was a codependency of um, on somebody. They were codependent on you or you to them. Or they are overindulging because they do they do have the three of cups here. Um, could be drugs or alcohol. Um, why is this devil in reverse here? 
for Cancer's partner. Why is this devil in reverse here for Cancer's partner? Seven of Pentacles. So, yeah, you have just been sitting back and waiting. You've been working on yourself. And, um, and they expect you to do everything for them. Um, kind of a narcissistic uh, vibe going on here from your partner or ex-partner for this group of you. Why is this Three of Cups here? For, whoa. Or, why is this Three of Cups here for Cancer's uh, partner? The person Cancer is connected to. Why is this Three of Cups here? And Five of Wands. Um, you could have separated from this person because... They um, have cheated. There is a third party. There's a lot of competition um, to be with them. Why is this five of wands here? Please clarify this five of wands. Yeah, lots of competition. Um, they could be uh, stepping out on the relationship. Or the reason why this relationship ended was because they were stepping out. Very possibly could be with a fire sign or somebody that is very attractive, very um, confident in the way they are. Why is this two of cups here? Or they could have fire in their sun, moon, or rising. Why is this two of cups here for Cancer's partner? Okay, so the relationship got to be a lot of work, um, causing um, emotions to run dry. Um, they have They're taking on way too much. Um, they could be spread too thin because they're sp spending their time with somebody else as well. And it's really starting to break their back. Why is this Ten of Wands here? Can you clarify this Ten of Wands a little more? Yeah, so they are moving on from that, from that other energy, that other person. Um, they are coming back towards you is what I am hearing. For this group of you. Okay. For your your guys' overall energies, um, you, Cancer, have the Eight of Pentacles and the Four of Cups in reverse. <clears throat> and the Queen of Pentacles just fell out, the Eight of Pentacles again, and the Six of Swords in reverse. So with both Eight of Pentacles out there in both decks, you have been putting in all the work. You feel you have um, put in more than enough time and effort into making this relationship work. And all it's done is cause you to um, feel stuck. Your emotions are allowing you not to move on from this person. And it's time to take a step back, or not step back. It's time to um, realize just how far you've come, Cancer. You have put in so much work and you are so well grounded. Um, you are stable all by yourself. And um, and now you're just waiting for that offer to come back in. You're just sitting there waiting. Why is this four of cups here in reverse? Yeah. <laughs> what did I just say? You're sitting here waiting. You got the hangman to um, clarify. So definitely, you feel stuck. You are in a position where you can't move on or you don't want to move on, um, but you're tired of waiting. Why is the Six of Pentacles here for their partner? Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Okay, so they have the Three of Wands, and they're just, they're just trying to figure out what they um, need to do to bring balance back to their life. Um, it's kind of like the grass is greener where you water the lawn. They they had a third party and they took off. And now they're realizing they need to find their way back to you. Because they want to offer you a passionate new beginning. They want to start over fresh with you. Oh. Why is this ace of wands here? Okay, the seven of cups is... In the reverse. So they are also coming out of a time where they were confused. They didn't know what to do. Um, they didn't know who to choose. But they now know that it was not better where they went. They want to come back home to you. Why is this Ace of Wands here? Okay. 
and they have the fool. See, I, they, I said they wanted to come back and have a fresh start with you. Oops. Sorry, they were right side up. They want a new beginning, a fresh start, something, um, some... Yeah, they want stability again. They want to invest their time with you. And they want that sense of stability back. Why is the strength here in reverse? For their overall energy together. The hermit. So you feel like this situation has got you out of control. Like you feel like you have no control over the situation, but you do. You just have to go within. You have to let the universe guide you. Be spiritually lit bleh, spiritually led and um and believe in the universe and their timing. Divine timing is at work here. Why is the Knight of Wands here for their combined energy? <laughs> you have the Knight of Wands clarified by the Knight of Wands. So, um, they are going to come back very quick, very, um, just, they are going to storm in on that horse and, um, offer you just so much passion. They now realize what they lost since when they left you, their wishes are, did not come true. They are not fulfilled emotionally whatsoever. Why is this nine of cups here in reverse? Oops. I know one flipped over in here. Maybe not. I don't know. Okay. Why is this nine of cups here in reverse for cancer and their partner? There we go. Okay. The 10 of pentacles in reverse. So when they thought they were, um, when they were leaving, they, like I said, they thought the grass was greener. They realized very quickly because they also have the 10 of pentacles in another deck in reverse that you are their perfect match. You are their soulmate. You are everything that they want, the stability they need, the happy home, the happy family, the perfect job. They're quickly realizing that they want you anything else for cancer any other messages have any other messages for cancer and their partner for the month of february there we go the hanged man and the page of swords so um spirit is encouraging you just to be patient to um to hold on, you're um, nearing that completion of this transition phase. Um, so just take a um, take the time to really um, really become more spiritual um, because they are going to be enlightened. They are actually already. I see this in the very first um, second week of February. Um, they have been enlightened. So they will be returning soon, and they have been keeping a very close eye on you anyways. Um, why is this page of swords here? The chariot. Yeah, so they're moving towards you. They are coming. It's just going to take a little bit of time. Um, they have to leave this karmic partner that they are currently with. Um... But it is coming to an end. They know who they want to be with. They want to be with um, you. So you do have an ex returning cancer. And that's all the cards I got. So, um, yeah, there has always been a strong bond between you guys. There's always been chemistry. Um, and that never died. Even when they left or you left cancer, um, the chemistry is still there. Even when you think of them, you get butterflies in your stomach type of feeling um, is what I'm hearing from spirit. Um, that will never be lost because they are your soulmate and you definitely have an ex coming back before the end of February cancer. So 
I hope you enjoyed this reading. I hope it resonated with a large group of you. Once again, it will not resonate with everybody because this is YouTube and I obviously can't pick up on everyone's energies. So if it doesn't fit, don't make it, don't force it. Um, just try to catch me next time. I want to thank everybody for coming and like, commenting, sharing, subscribing. Um, without you, I would not be able to do what I love every day and this would not be possible. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And I hope you guys have a beautiful February and God bless.